Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Solinux Crypto and welcome to a new video on Solana, which um, maybe against expectations has been relatively bullish. All right, what we're seeing um, and um, <clears throat> obviously we'll, we'll, we'll do a full update on that. But what you can see right now is that, first of all, yesterday evening after the after the Federal Reserve interest rate decision, we gained quite a lot of momentum. And over the last couple of hours, we've been relatively strong as well. And then apart from that, which, by the way, I also tweeted about yesterday, uh, we also got some sort of a bullish reclaim. All right. And that, in general right now, I mean, I, I, I hold quite a lot of Solana. So, so this is obviously good to see. But in general, I think if you if you compare Solana with other meme coins right now, it looks quite good. Um, and what I suspect, and that is also something we can already expect because the, the Bitcoin dominance is dropping down. But what I expect uh, is this, that the Solana against Bitcoin, which I did draw something on, as you can see right here, that's looking pretty good. I don't want to say it's bullish yet, all right? But I do want to say that we are getting towards some levels uh, right here, that if we do break above that, then Solana against Bitcoin can actually turn very, very bullish, which would be bullish for Solana, and which would mean that we can get much more bullish momentum than this. Um, now, I do want to say that I don't want to get ahead of myself. All right, right now we are getting some bullish indications, for example, which is still super important. What you see from Bitcoin is that we are gaining some momentum and most importantly, you can see some, some, some sort of absorption or you can, some sort of, you can see some spot buys coming in. Now that's interesting, but I do think, look, Solana right now, it's, it's, it's relatively strong, right? So we have this resistance level around 136, uh, but by getting this bullish uh, reclaim we did yesterday evening, um, while at the same point of time, we're also gaining some momentum earlier this morning and we're also getting spot buys, it looks most likely uh, that we're in for a little bit of recovery, all right? Up to the 200 EMA right here <clears throat> at 137, but also up to this level right here at, at 141 and 144. So that looks quite likely. Uh, however, I do think to actually get some sort of a short-term recovery like this, which by the way, if you zoom out, getting a recovery up there is still bearish, all right? So you can see we're still in that downtrend. Uh, so to break above that downtrend, I think that I, I think that's too far away, all right? Because for that, you would need much more momentum than this. So I don't think that's happening. Um, but even getting even getting some uh, short-term short -term recovery here, I think is good news. And I do think at this moment, something like that is most likely the one thing that's missing, because like I said, we got a bullish reclaim right here. We're gaining some momentum and just market wide, you do see some sort of recovery, right? So if you look at Bitcoin, that's a little bit more green. Uh, the total three is holding up fairly well. So the main thing we're missing, I would say, is an actual bullish breakout from Bitcoin. That's the only thing. All right, I think Bitcoin needs to get some sort of a breakout above 58,500. If that happens, I think a move like this is confirmed. And then from that level, once once we hit 140, 144, etc., then we can start to talk about, all right, can we actually break above that? At this moment, that seems unlikely because the momentum would be would need to be much, much higher. Uh, but who knows? All right, a lot is possible in crypto. So I'll keep you updated on that, of course. Um, in the end, we were at those levels as well the, the, back like two weeks ago. So it's not, uh, it's, it's not the, the most difficult thing in the world. Just at this moment, in these circumstances, I don't expect it. But I do think this is most likely. All right, so those are my thoughts. Keep your eyes on Bitcoin. In general, still be careful. But for now, those are my thoughts. So thank you for watching. Take care and bye.